Hey everyone, I'm Silas Q and welcome back to my channel. So before I jump into this video, I just want to quickly say once again, thank you, thank you so much for watching me and for subscribing if you're already a sub of mine. If not, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can get notified every time I upload a new video. So, wait, one more thing before I start the video. I want a name for our little family because we are growing and I don't know, I don't want to keep calling you guys my little YouTube family. I mean, you guys are my little YouTube family, but I want it to be more personal and, you know, our thing. So far, my husband gave me one name, uh, Cutie Cues, so Cutie Cues, yeah, Cutie Cues, and I came up with Sea Lions because my name is Silas Q, so Silas Q, C-Line, Silas, C-Line, I don't know, I, th I thought it kind of flowed nicely. I'm not biased towards my name at all, but I want to have you guys help me and give me some suggestions, so leave them in the comments box below. I really want it to be our thing where at least we come up with the name and you guys help me pick a name for our little family here, so yeah. So help me out and give me some suggestions down below. And if you see a comment and you like the name someone else came up with, help me out by giving it a thumbs up so I know which one you guys like the most. Yeah, I think that's about it. So I think we should get right into this video. This video is a questions and answers video. And I posted on my Instagram and my Facebook what you guys wanted to know about me. So I left it completely open. You could have asked whatever crazy questions you wanted. Lex397 asked me five questions, so thank you so much for asking me so many questions. It makes me feel happy that you want to know so much about me, so thank you. She asked me how old are... I was gonna say how old are my... <laughs> how old am I? Um, I'm 22. How tall am I? I am almost 5'3". Yeah, almost 5'3", I'm pretty short. Who taught you how to do makeup? Honestly, I taught myself and I got the amazing help from YouTube. I watched so many other YouTubers out there. What is your nationality? I am Guyanese and Portuguese. What do I do for a living? Um, actually, I don't do anything. Not yet, at least. Um, that sounds horrible. I make it sound horrible, but honestly, I'm not gonna come on come on camera and give you like a bullshit story of what I do. I don't do anything for a living. I am a stay-at-home wife and I consider myself a stay-at-home mommy as well because I have two pets and I give them all the love in the world and I'm a housewife at the moment that cooks and clean and takes care of my kids. So that is what I do at home and now I do YouTube and it's just so much fun. I guess because I stay at home I have time to do videos. So I said, why not? So this is what I do. I am a stay-at-home wife and mommy and I film YouTube videos. There we go. I don't know how to say this. A more sincerely, I think that's how you say it. She asked me if you could switch place with one YouTuber, who would it be and why? That is a really good question. Um, I would pick Hey Claire. She has a cute kitty, I want to pet it. Lucifer Lee. How cool is the name? Very cool. So, yeah, her cat is cool. Her life is cool. She travels. Uh, she has so many gorgeous tattoos that I'm too scared to, to put on me. Um, she's just so interesting and ta interesting, yeah, interesting and talented that I would switch places with her. For like, only for a day or something, because, I don't know, I want to be me. Daphne Noel. She asked me, who is your favorite YouTuber and why? Hey Claire, <laughs> I just said it. She's an amazing editor, uh, she's gorgeous, she's so interested, and she seems like such a friendly and sincere person that I would, I would want to get to know her. So yeah, she's my favorite YouTuber. Samantha Teresa16 and Nadira Real asked me, why did I start a YouTube channel? So I feel like I sound like everybody else when I say I started a YouTube channel because I was bored and I was <laughs> lonely. Lonely isn't I don't have any friends like that and I didn't have any friends like that. I probably have like two really good friends and that's my best friend Jay and my other best friend. 
Erica, Alexandra, I try to pronounce your name the best I can. Alexandra? Alexandria? I don't know. She also does YouTube, so I'll link her channel below. You should definitely check her out. Her makeup game is whoop. She lives like the middle of nowhere. She lives pretty much far away from me, so that's sad. I have no one around here except Jane. You guys want to be my friend? Any of you live around here? Let's hang out. Please? No, I'm kidding, but, um, yeah, no, I'm not, I'm not kidding. I have two friends. Pretty much. Like, yeah. Anyhow, this video has taken to a depressing turn. I'm more of the creative arts side, so, oh yeah, that's another reason why I started YouTube. I love making things. Um, in high school, I had ceramic class, I had painting, I had drawing, and I love taking photos, I love filming things, I always want to remember moments and stuff like that, so why not YouTube? YouTube basically, you know, it sums up all of the things that I love, so yeah, that is why I started my YouTube channel. My brother Jason Silas asked me what is my favorite song. At the moment, my favorite song is Boo De Boo Ai by Wilbur Pan. Yeah, I, I'm just going to link that down below just in case you guys need some help spelling it. Um, it's just a really calm and soothing song that it just puts me in a good mood. I could be in the worst mood ever and if I listen to that song, I just, I feel happy. And Miss Sugar XO, she asked me two questions. She asked me how to make your hair grow so long. I will be posting a video about that actually. It should be a... Uh, Maybe next week time, because I have so many video ideas planned that um, it's just, it's, it's crazy up here. But that video is definitely coming out soon. It really is. I believe someone else asked me that question too. So yes, that video, it will be out most likely next week. And the next question that she asked me was, and when will it come out? So it will be out most likely next week, ending of next week. If not, definitely the week after. I will keep you posted. I have you on Instagram. I will hit you up and let you know, you know, if it's happening next week or happening the week after. Guy Thomas asked me, what is my dream holiday? My dream holiday would have to be going back to my home country, Guyana, with all of my family members and just having a really good time because I never... I never went back to my country and have all of my family members around. In the past couple years, they went back without me because I couldn't go. This is a really good question by Guy Thomas again. Who inspired me to do YouTube? Oh boy. Um. Well, I guess I could say Whaley, That's Heart, um, Hey Claire. They inspired me to do YouTube because they make it look like it's so much fun. I always loved watching That's Heart and Whaley's vlog channel. I want to start doing vlog. What do you guys think? I don't know. Like, I did one vlog and I don't know how you guys feel about it, but I'm considering vlogging. It looks like so much fun and like I said, I want to remember everything because I have a really bad memory and I feel really sad thinking about the fact that there's a possibility I can wake up one day and not remember important things. So I would like to vlog and capture it. It doesn't even have to like be vlogging for you guys. I think I might just start vlogging for me and keep it. But if you guys want to see me vlog, then I'll upload it. Jessica Michelin? She asked me, am I an actress and if yes, what movies that I play in. Actress? I don't think so. I've been in like one thing. That doesn't count as anything. Miss Sugar XO asked me another question. She goes, she goes, <laughs> well, she said, when are you going to do a morning and night routine? Oh man, those are so popular. Uh, I don't necessarily do videos because they're popular. I do it because that popped into my head that week or something and I really want to share that with you. So, do you guys want to see a morning and night routine? I mean, she does, so I'll definitely do it for my subscriber. So, I will be filming a morning and night routine, but do, you, do any of you guys want to see it as well? Because if so, I will push those type of videos out quicker for you guys, because that is what you requested, instead of something like that I wanted to film 
for you guys. If you really want to see a night routine and a morning routine, thumbs up this video and leave it in the comments box below so I know to hurry up and film that for you guys. Ask me when am I going to do it? So, uh, I don't know. Don't the week after next week, if anything. Unless you guys want it faster, then I will get my lazy behind up and clean for you guys. <laughs> so yeah, let me know if you guys want to see that ASAP. There's Q, my troll of a husband. <laughs> Kidding! No, he's a troll, he's a troll. He asked me, I gotta read this because it's like a whole sentence, paragraph, thingamajig that I'm not gonna remember. So let me read it to you, word for word. He said, I heard from a little bit. Can't read, can't talk, can't do any of that today. I heard from a reliable source that you lied in your YouTube video just to pie your husband. Is that true? He's talking about um the video that I have up, uh, what is it called? Oh my god, I don't know what it's called. How well do you know me? How something like that? I don't know. It's a it's the video that has a thumbnail of him having like whipped cream in his face. That's the video he's talking about. So in that video, we had to ask each other a question and if one of us got the question wrong, like if we answered it wrong, we get whipped cream smashed in our face. I did not lie in that video, so he is lying. I just changed my answer and he didn't know it. So the, the question that he asked me was, who's my favorite Naruto character? And I think he said Kakashi. You, some of you must be lost, but um, for all the Naruto fans out there, hey girl, hey! <laughs> okay, I don't know what that was, but yeah! Um, I'm, I'm a huge anime fan, just throwing it out there, so... If you have any good animes, let me know! Because I'm home! Yeah, I don't have time to watch it! <laughs> um, yeah, so he's lying. It's just, my favorite character changed and his ass just didn't know it. So he's trying to accuse me of lying. I did not lie. He just don't know what he's talking about. Last question, and it's by Quay Marie. If I'm saying your name wrong, I'm so, so, so sorry. Don't hate me. She asked me, how did you and your husband meet and fell in love? <laughs> and she said, she thinks we're cute. Thank you. At a anime convention and we fell in love. How did we fall in love? I just fell in love with him because we were young and crazy. I got married at 19, so that's, I think that's pretty crazy for some people. Um, we were just obsessed with each other. Literally, he would go to work and he'll be texting me 24-7. And like as soon as he comes out of work, we'll be on the phone the entire time until we go to sleep. And even when we went to sleep, we would stay on the phone and listen to each other sleep. So we fall asleep with the phone on. Um, so technically I'll wake up to him or something like that unless he has to go to work or I have to go to school and yeah, it would just be like text, call, fall asleep on the phone, see each other in person. It was just, it's crazy. Uh, that's how we fell in love. We were just around each other or had something to do each with each other like 24-7 and I feel like, I don't know, he was everything I was looking for. Yeah. There you go. Like, that, that's it. He was everything I was looking for and I think it was kind of love at first sight, that kind of thing. I was like, mm-hmm, he looked good. That's what happened. That's, that's what happened. Yeah, love at first sight. We were walking past each other, and I'm short, like, really short. Like I said, 5'3", not even almost 5'3". No, my bullshit, not 5'3". I'm almost 5'3". So I'm walking in, like, a crowd of people. He's walking this... No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, he's walking this way, and I'm walking this way. And, like, we happen to cross paths. So like, and then the entire time we're walking past each other, we're staring at each other in like a crowd of people. And I'm over here looking at this guy like, is he looking at me? Me? I'm looking around like, any other cute girls here? There's tons of cute girls. I mean, come on, it was at the anime convention. There's like cute girls dressed up as like, what is it? I don't know, like cute ass little Pokemon girls and stuff. What are some girls that look like Pokemon? So yeah, there's girls like that going around. So I'm like, he's not looking at me. So out of confusion, because I'm a total ape, I start scratching my head. I was like, huh? Like, totally lost, like, what's going on? Like, is he checking me out? No, I don't think he's checking me out. So I started scratching my head. And then he said that he saw me go like this or something, and it looked like I went like this, like, come over. So he came over to me, and we started talking, and apparently, I just put my number in his phone. I don't remember. Like I said, I have bad memory. If that happened, I don't know. Did it happen like that? I don't know. That's what he said, that I just took his phone, I put my number in, and, yeah, we just... 
Well, we went our separate ways. And that night, like later that night, I think, yeah, I think he messaged me. And we literally could not stop talking after that. It was, that's when everything started. And it was non-stop talking, non-stop messaging, on the phone, seeing each other. And yeah, that's how we met. That's how we fell in love, I guess. <laughs> I hope I did a decent job explaining that. Um, yeah, so that was the last question, guys. Thank you so much for watching me, and if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe so you can get future videos of mine. I have so many videos coming out. I got how I grow my hair, because honestly, I had a horrible haircut, and it was pretty short, and now my hair is pretty long. It might not look that long because it's in a high ponytail and whatnot, but it's pretty long so I will be doing a video on how I grow my hair and because you asked for it a nighttime morning routine all that what else what else what else I don't want to forget anything oh tons of DIY videos I have so many ideas to share with you guys like I said that will be coming really really soon uh what else yeah just so much ideas and so much videos coming your way so subscribe so you can get notified every time I upload a new video and don't forget I want to know everything there is to know about you well whatever you want to share with me and comfortable sharing with me leave it in the comments box below just have a conversation going back and forth because I don't want to be one way where you guys just watch me I want to know about you guys as well I think this is the most important thing we need a name for our little family here because that is literally what I call you guys, my little YouTube family, and we need a name or a little Silas Q family. That is not creative at all. So help me find a name. So far I have Cutie Q's and uh, what is it? Sea Lions, like I said before, because Sea Last Q, Sea Lion, I don't know. It made sense in my head somehow. So yeah, leave your suggestions down below and Rue, do you hear that car? Rude, or is that a bike? I don't know. Whatever. Rude. Um, yeah, yeah. I, I, I have really short attention span, bro. Like, really short. But leave the name suggestions down below. And if you see a name that you like already, give it a thumbs up. So I can, it can help me decide which one is better. Help me see which one you guys like more. Because clearly if you thumbs it up the most, that means you guys want to be called that. Thank you, thank you so, so much for watching again, and I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye, guys.